just live A day without you, baby And I'll give you all of me I'll be the best that I can be And I know I'm not perfect, babe But I promise I'll try every day So with yours and yours with mine And give you all of me And intertwine Kevin, honestly when you came to my house the first time, I, uh, <laughs> I did have a shotgun, but uh, <laughs> you never saw it. As an example to all of us that love isn't about the easy. It's about truly overcoming the hard to enjoy the good. Ever since I was younger, um, I always wanted a sister but I got two brothers instead. <laughs> Kevin has always been there with me to cry. He's been my protector and I've always been his protector. So when he enlisted in the Navy, my biggest worry was not being able to protect him anymore. Uh, but thankfully, he had you, Steph. And so Stephanie, I'm so happy to finally call you my sister. to you and generously giving you Stephanie. She's a gift to you, and you are to prize her as a precious gift. It is God's kindness that he has brought Stephanie into your life to help you, to strengthen you, and empower you to be the man God has called you to be. True biblical love not only gives generously, commits freely, but finally, true biblical love sacrifices willingly. You see, marriage gives us the shape of the gospel and it points to reality beyond ourselves. Kevin and Stephanie, if you want your marriage to be successful and blessed, you both need to love God more than you love one another. And because when you love God more than one another, you will love one another better than you imagine because God's love is a sacrificial love. for Stephanie than Kevin. You know, he's an amazing person. And um, I know that he's gonna take care of Stephanie with the same love and the same intensity that I've always taken care of her with. So on behalf of the family, welcome, Kevin. There's no turning back. Um, Stephanie, my little sunshine, I love you dearly. I'm so happy that you have found your other half.
you found a very special place in my daughter's heart. Uh, you have a very special place in our family. We welcome you, and I wish you both have a great, great marriage, a great life, and in about 20 years, I want some children, you know, some grandchildren. <laughs> Stephanie, you are a remarkable woman. You are so caring, so kind, so smart, so unbelievably right all the time. <laughs> I love how you always dance once you get your food when we go out for dinner. <laughs> and I love how you never ever let me forget how much you love me. I truly don't know what I've done for God to have blessed me with such a great woman. I can't tell you enough how grateful I am that you have stuck by my side through thick and thin. I promise to always give you my best. I promise to always make things right before going to bed. I promise I'll try to remember to close the shower curtain when I'm done. <laughs> I promise to try to not wake you up when I'm moving you, when you take up 90% of the bed. I promise to love you to the best of my abilities. When times get rough, I'll love you through it all. When you have a hard day at work, I'll be there to listen. And when you're sick in bed, I'll be in the living room because I'm not trying to get sick. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'll be right there holding you and waiting on your hand and foot. I love you, my best friend, my soulmate, my wife, my everything. <laughs>